All right, guys, how's it going? So, want to start off by saying happy 4th of July because that is when this video shall be released to the old interwebs. Now, I want to say that I looked all over the workshop for either, you know, an Independence Day theme, a 4th of July theme, or even a White House theme. And, like, literally the only type of thing that I could find was like some you know ported five maps and like a five uh spawn a five map spawn room challenge and the problem with those is i've already done those don't really want to do them again you know i have beat five to death um but other than that there's really nothing else so with that being said i just wanted to find a map that looked fun that had a bible end in it even though this one was posted in march 22 uh it looks like it's really fun has great reviews and uh, it has a Bible ending. So we got custom weapons, custom wonder weapons, custom characters, non-copyrighted music, custom round uh, change stingers. I don't know what that is, honestly. Custom perks, inventory, custom <clears throat> custom font, zombie shield, Bible ending, multiple side Easter eggs, and incomplete main quest. But I'm mainly, you know, let's just enjoy the map. And, you know, I was like, look, flipping it's... This is going to be my 4th of July video, so what is something that people like to eat on 4th of July? People like fruit um, and pineapples. I, you see pineapples on the 4th of July. So anyways, that is the map that we are playing. So we're going to just go ahead and get that loaded up and hopefully <clears throat> have a very fun, nifty experience. Because we've got the uh, we got the caffeine flowing to the fingertips. Got a beverage. I got a, uh, what do we got? Orange mango frost, bro. These sparkling waters are actually pretty, uh, pretty tasty. So we got that. Plus, I got a bottle of water over there behind me. Uh, and so also, this was apparently like a map that the creator of this made. You know, a while. I don't know. If he said I didn't read the full description. You can go back and read it. You can check this out on the Steam Workshop if you'd like to. But anyways, this is like a remake of a map that he had made in the past. I don't know if it, if he had made it on BO3 or if it was like a War at War map. Not sure, because this, I don't know, whenever I see this, this map kind of <clears throat> gives me a War at War vibe, honestly. Just the initial, I don't know, like the initial presentation of it, but it was probably one that he just made very early on in the custom BO3 zombie arena. <clears throat> oh, man. Tasty. I don't know about you fellas, but I'm somebody, like, I prefer my... I prefer my waters and things to be room temperature. Okay, so we got a pineapple. Okay, I'm sure he put that there just so that... <clears throat> God dang allergies, bro. Just so that we would see it. Um, there's a bunch of vases around, so we may or may not have to... Oh, you know what? Look, this actually does work, because it looks like we're like one of like a flipping FBI men in black type agent over there as our character model. So... I guess we got that going for us as far as the theme is concerned. Something about this vase over here looks like we might have a soul collector. Oh, that says clear debris. I thought that was a flipping window. Okay, nothing collected there. Don't see. Okay, yeah, okay. I, these vases must just be for aesthetic purposes. Wait, wait. To stop playing. Oh, 69K, so the Bible ending is literally in the starting room so i think i mean i think that's because the original version of this map was just meant to be a survival map and that's kind of what he intended this one to be but you know i you know whenever it comes to custom zombies and for the video's sake it's nice to kind of like have a legitimate objective <clears throat> okay there's nothing really indicating the valhalla what okay well it said cut like a bunch of custom stuff so that right there looks like it's the shield, and then we got the remnants. Um, okay, I'm, I'm going to say go this way. Okay, there's the Beretta. Press to pick up part. Okay, that's a shield part. Okay, and so we don't need to turn on any power, it seems. Wait, is there a window in here? Okay, no. No window. So we got that going for us. These skinny fellas, bro, the skinny ones, they're always the feistiest, you know? Boom. Oh, but I'm loving it, bro. So, if you can't tell, though, this was recorded in advance because you already know that your boy here is going to be busy on the grill. 
on this uh, when you're seeing this to find day of Fourth of July because I've actually like I don't know I really love I love grilling stuff, bro. Honestly, like it's become it's become a real hobby. That and just that that and campfire cooking. Uh, if you've never done it, highly recommend it. It's a good time. And like, don't don't feel uh, don't feel intimidated to get started. Just you know, like I would say, if you're new to it or never really done it, you know, just start with some, you know, inexpensive meats or something along that line. I mean, you know, what I'm saying like, don't go out and you know buy yourself a twenty thirty dollar steak and try to flip and you know fricassee it up on the grill uh, for your first time. But you know, just you know, start off with some decent like hamburgers and make make yourself some cheeseburgers or even hot dogs is a good way to start just to get a a idea of how to manage the heat and just learn the functionality of it but then i already know i got some flipping og homies on here flipping that are dads or just in that age range that i'm sure already flipping masters on the grill so you know i tip my hat to you good sirs okay we got all this tall grass out here so normally anytime you got tall grass it's uh also Serves the purposes of hiding some of the goodies that we need to collect, but we are, we do really need a, a weapon here. Okay, so I see Ray Gun Mark II. Okay, you know what, I'll take the Vector. Get some nice 45 ACP in these fellas. Boop. Okay, I want to get that nuke if we can uh, find the last group bomb here there we go I was really expecting a different uh, death machine okay this is two G's return me okay so this vase does something but apparently the other ones doesn't which is I find that interesting return me okay very okay. Maybe, maybe we got to collect souls in this one. Oh, let's get them rounded up. This right here could very well end up being our uh, the main area that we train in. Okay, I don't know if that's something that can be dug up. That's the first little mound of stuff I've seen, but that kind of stands out to me. No, I mean, like, there's not, I'm not really, like, super into the idea of doing, like, whatever this main Easter egg is, because I don't know how long it would take, but depending on how quick, oh, depending on how quickly we we move through opening up this map, and then, you know, acquiring, oh, okay, so we got elephants, but that's, you know, probably for the music, I mean, it's got to be for the music, it's got the flipping, the old, you know, come here. Okay, so no soul collection going on there. Let's start while we're still on like a low round four. We just kind of circle around this large area and try to get an idea of what's going on. I'm kind of thinking too now that the uh, that Jug might have been outside of that other spawn room door just because we had stamina up. Because there's a double tap. Oh, no, never mind. This is that spawn room door. Okay, well, I'm glad I looked here. So, we got double tap there. I, I got to make sure I also keep looking up high. Because the only thing I'm thinking is about those glowing... Oh, those right there. Those glowing green pineapples is that may or may not, like, unlock a free wonder weapon or special something another. A free perk. Who knows? Is this just the M16? M16A4. Okay. Just something about all these vases and these, like, different locations or... I don't know. I guess maybe that's why they've done it. Or maybe they just... Like, maybe they chose vases because of, uh... I don't know. Those vases look somewhat like pineapples, right? Or at least these do. Model 680. Could have made this grass just a little bit shorter because it's not the easiest thing in the world to... See how many we got. Okay. How many we got left? Okay. We just want to leave two. Ouch. Okay. So we got two slow ones left. 
just want to go ahead over here and touch this big pineapple real quick. Okay. Okay, so this thing says return me. My nose itches. Okay. Very interesting. Hopefully I haven't missed a door. I don't think there was no door down there. Oh, but there is a pineapple. Oh, and we got our max ammo. Okay. I'm just going to get that so that it quits making all the noise. Okay, there's a door. Okay, that just drops back down the center. Okay. I feel like all this is just going to end up looping back around the same... Well, maybe not. I guess we end up going kind of like underneath this waterfall. Make sure there ain't no glowing green things right here that I just straight up neglected to see. Okay, jabbing juice. Oh, okay, I, never mind. Okay, I remember that one. Like, I think that it like increases melee damage along with melee range. Bro, I am so confuzzled as to where Jug is. I guess it's on the other side, so we'll just have to try to max out the points from these guys. Because I think I need to go ahead and actually buy another uh, box weapon because my vector is probably going to be running short on the old ammunition. Oh, okay, you know what? I th I'm pretty sure I gained more points that way. We'll just drop down middle. Oh. Okay, that's spawn. And then this is this. Ah, oh, poop. I would have had plenty of, uh... Ooh. The garter. I'm not sure. Oh. I'm not sure where the garter's from. I don't remember that from a college. Oh. Last one. Sure is. The garter. I mean, this just looks like a 357 Magnum. Please be a speed loader. Yes. Sweet. Okay. Well, this thing must is most definitely going to be probably like a one-shot weapon. So, we got that going for us. So, I just wish the fire rate was... Not potato level. And another thing I'm thinking too, where this is like an Egyptian type theme map. Oh, it'd be a one shot if I could hit something with it. Uh, see, like in the Egyptian garbage, that like a lot of times you know they have like hidden doors and flipping tombs and stuff. So, very good chance there might be some hidden doors, or that might be what the whole pineapple thing's about. Is like you know unlocking whatever some type of hidden area very very within the realm of possibility i swear my accuracy is not like complete trash it's just this thing is like it has a weird animation that makes you want to like kind of throws off your it just kind of throws your aim off honestly because like you want like whenever you see the muzzle lift which is actually that's a genuine, like, because this is, where this is like a, he's using the double action, uh, you know, instead of, like, pulling the hammer back, uh, like, what am I, okay, so if you don't know weapons, double action revolvers, you can pull the trigger, but it's got a very, very heavy trigger pull, so it's less accurate, but, it, like, it normally leads to that, but, anyway, sorry, there's no point in me even explaining that, okay, how many we got, how many we got, I am enjoy using it, though, it feels nice feels powerful, you know? Makes you feel like an independent woman. 
Would you just look at that pineapple? Okay, I'm going to go this way just because Jug might be over here. God dang it. They made it to where you can't see it on purpose. That does not look like Jug. I'll do it one more time. Sorry, I know I'm leaning like probably out of the flipping frame. I don't know if it is or not. We're going to try and see what. Nope. God, of course. That'd be dead shot. Like the last perk I ever want to get. I can definitely see there being some like pineapples like hidden up in these rocks. Okay, and then wait, how much is this? Seventeen fifty, okay. Well Oh Until I get jug, I don't want to get too cocky with, like, you know, staying in uh, any of these kind of more confined areas. I also really need to be on the lookout for shield parts. Because having a shield is always a good idea. I really figured there would be some shield parts. I need to do a better job of like checking out these pillars that are in the middle. Because I've kind of just been hugging the edges of the map. Or the edges of this field. Oh, bad idea. Tall grass really, really screws with your ability. Oh, what did I tell you? It's almost like I've played custom zombies before, you know? Would you believe it? Okay, perfect timing. Well, actually, no. We actually we, we had a, we had a lot of ammo for this. Okay, so we got one, two. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, one, two, three. Is there another one back there? Oh. Hello? Hello? Okay. So we got two. Definitely cannot wait to get stamina up. Once you get used to having stamina up and, like, not have, you know, having the fast feats, then not having it just feels like you're walking at negative 10 mile per hour. Wait, what is... What is this? Okay, that was a puddle. There we go! Oh, and we don't even have enough for it. How nice is that? Okay, we got any glowing green pineapples in here? There's Pack-a-Punch. Well, there's definitely more pineapples because... Oh! Sweet. I think we got enough to build the shield now. There's probably like a pineapple in here on the other side of the Pack-a-Punch, if I had to guess. Or, nope, the pineapples is how we unlock the Pack-a-Punch. That's what it is. Guaranteed. Because it's guarded by a bunch of pineapples. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely... We'll find it here in a, here in a bit or two. I'm going to see if I can just knife these guys and get the points that I need. I think by the time I kill both of them, I'll have just enough. Yeah. 
Yes. Okay. Bro, you know, okay, so, like, so I, know, I know I keep going back to this whole uh, tall grass thing, but I would almost guarantee that they have stuck a pineapple, like, somewhere in the midst of all that dry, the, the tall grass. Because that's just the type of thing these custom zombie fellas are into, you know? So we're going to have to, like, bloodhound our way around. I will do that right now if I had my zombie shield on my back, but I do not. So I guess the next order of business is get to where we can build the shield, get speed cola, then maybe consider getting a new weapon. Uh, this vector is not the worst gun ever, but the damage seems to really be falling off. Because, I mean, like, at only round nine, we should be getting a little bit better damage consistency here. But playing ring around the pineapple is working out pretty good right here. Since they're not, like, all, you know, sprinting yet. Okay. Hello. There we go. So, since we got double points, I just wanted to go ahead and end this round. Let's buy the box, get rid of the vector, maybe get something else that'll hit a little bit harder. Ooh, Finn, okay. Finn's a nice little ripper. Okay, reload speed's very nice with this little uh, garter now. Nice. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and open this up. That way we can build our shield. Okay, that was very quick. Mm, I was really hoping there would be a pineapple in here. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Let's, like, just chuck some grenades around. I just hope there's a prompt that's like, you know, Pack-A-Punch has been open. Okay, yep, hip fire is not the way to go with this thing. Oh, no, I made crawlers. I'm sorry, I'm just, like, keeping my vision down right now, like, to try and see if I can flip and spot anything that may or may not be glowing. I mean, even though this thing has, like, a really slow fire rate, uh, it is getting some, like, pretty solid collaterals, it seems. And then when, you know, with custom zombies, like, you could take and have a weapon like this and then pack a punch it and the god dang thing shoots missiles or is fully automatic or who knows what. But I'm glad I picked this map. Okay, I do not want to get that. What am I doing? I've already threw grenades over here. Okay, you know what? Let's try this method. You'll see we hit zombies with it, so...
Aha! There's another one? How many are there? See, like, the thing about these is sometimes it's just all about the viewing angle, you know? Because if you don't have the right viewing angle... Oh, wait, the pineapples might have moved and it just didn't have a prompt. And I don't see... Like, but then again, we're on, like, a very high rise there. Oh, I hope there's not any in the windows. I didn't think about that. I really can't tell if there's any pineapples in front of that now or not. Oh! Hey! That was the last one. Boom. Five Gs. Let's go! So I think that's pretty much that. That's pretty much it on this map other than maybe another like an Easter egg or something. Well, said the main Easter egg isn't there, but there's like Okay. Okay, well, let's just get back to the carnage, bro. We'll get back to, like, you know, flipping, slamming them points. This is a very fun, chill, you know, great map to play on the holidays type of deal. What? 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 I know that the one before the like the one that killed it. I didn't miss that one. I'll own up to it. Uh, but let's get a double tap for the funsies. I re I do want to pack a punch just a garter, but I'm gonna buy the box to see if we get a wonder weapon. I love the FAL, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep with this thing for now. But we'll use the fin to uh, to rack up points. Okay, that did help the fire rate quite a bit. We just hold them off from here. I got, I reckon, I gekin, I gawkin. There we go. Sarah McLaughlin in the arms of an angel. I don't think I've seen mule kick, so I guess mule kick's not on here. Or I just ran right by it without looking at it. <sighs> So yeah, we progressed through this map relatively easily. This right here, this looks like, uh, you know, so if I'm like a Secret Service agent, and it's back in like the 70s, I guess I would be caught carrying a revolver anyways. Oh, Jesus Christ, bro. I don't know what's up with my thumbs today. They just are not on the cooperative setting. You know, a custom perk I think that would be kind of interesting to see in custom zombies would be like a uh, would be like a hip fire perk that would just like dial in your weapons uh, hip fire crosshairs to be like extremely you know accurate. Not not like aimbot, not like to like where the bullets just flipping you know fly into the zombie or anything, just to where basically it would give you like the prone level of accuracy, but while you're like standing and running around. Okay, so we'll get this double point, we'll rock these zombies worlds, and then try to leave one and go get, we'll go pack a punch the old garter. The old garter. Boop, boop. 
just, you know, still, still missing that old zombie kill counter. Boom! Last round. Oh, we got another double points, though. I don't like letting those go to waste. Especially when there's a Bible ending we gotta get. Just in time for the doggos. And we already know that the AA-12 is like always god tier if you pack a punch it. That's why I really wish we had a, uh, a mule kick on here. Bro, what is this range? I guess we can go over here real quick and co oh, cop some stamina up. Well, I thought it said there was no perk limit. Well, that's some doodly squat. Man. It's like I've been bamboozled. Maybe I was looking at a different... Uh, just thought maybe I was just looking at something different. But yeah, this thing is no longer the one shot. Man, I am stamina up sucks. Yeah, I mean, I already know if you pack, if I pack a punch. I want to pack a punch the guarder first. Not if I have enough money to pack a punch both, but I feel like I'm probably going to end up like just buying a wall gun or something so that we can really stack points. Oh, don't want that. Okay, I mean, we got got one. Do we just got one? Okay, maybe we do. Wait, I said, wait, you haven't figured that out. So, return me. I don't know what that means. Because so far, not a single thing has done any soul collecting. Maybe I need to get that other... Maybe that thing isn't a, a, like a, a song after all. Maybe it's like I need to... Uh... I also keep seeing these boxes. Maybe I'll kill a zombie near the box before. Okay. So this is actually just a pretty standard pack a punch situation. I'm just trying to hug these dark walls real quick just to see if anything is available to be picked up. Hmm. Come here, dummy. That didn't do nothing. Just kind of based off the the way this map is like is set up. 
I feel like I'm missing something very obvious. Okay, well, so now these guys literally just explode. If you hit them in the head, at least. Oh. Okay, my shield just turned yellow. See, it doesn't show what the remnants are, like what they look like. I feel like we're in that flipping scene of, uh, of the Expendables when what's his name is Terry Crews as like the AA-12. Okay. I've got my game. I've got the uh, the music audio turned off. So if you're wondering why you don't hear nothing, that's why. Bro, there's all these jars, and I just so feel like that means something. Or they do something. Nice! We racking up them headshots, though, brothers. Let's get some grenade points. Put our grenades to use. Wait, has this thing got, like, snake shot rounds now? I think it might. Yeah, I believe it does. That's one reason why we're... We can actually hit fire this thing now. Yep. Nice. Oh, man. I need that. Oh, but we got the double points as well. Okay, this will be a good point gun. I guess I just shoot all the pineapples or something, see what happens. Because even though this is a shotgun now, it seems to have like unlimited range. Okay, let's party with the bison for a minute. I was hoping it would have the larger magazine on it, but... Okay, you know what? It hits hard though. Is that a double points? Oh, 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 oh. No. If that would fix my shield, I'd get it. But I don't want to slow these guys down. I want them to spawn in as quick as they can. You know, sure, I think most of them are spawning in through the ground. No, run, run, run. That's where, mm, that's where I have stamina up. Sucks. Massive donkey wiener. Okay. Finish that one off perfectly. Absolutely nothing. Oops, so I had to pause and go check on something. Boom, we got our doggos popping in. You know what, screw it. Let's go ahead and hit the box. I know I could maximize points. Wait, is this the first one? No, sweet. I know I could have maximized points by using the uh, the bison. I don't even got to reload. Nope. 
Sweet. But I'm, I'm glad a pack punch is pissed. I mean, obviously, if we get our backs up against the wall, there's no... Um, Hmm. Sorry, I know if we get our backs up against the wall, there's not like a you know fast fire rate really, but this thing seems to have a decent uh, shot spread on it and does damage to multiple zombies within your vicinity, so we'll make it work. Okay, we'll, 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 let's, let's train these guys. It's also nice to have a pistol just for mobility reasons because, you know, you have a lot faster uh, sprint and such. And the hit fire is also very nice, so we ain't really got to aim anymore. See, look at that. We just took out a whole wave. We could have done that with, like, six shots, but I used uh, eight. Okay, I think my shield... Is my shield gone? No, but it is about to be. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Well, that was my fault. I was being stupid. Well, we got plenty of points. I'm also somebody who enjoys a good comeback, but not having stamina up is so hard. Come on, come on, come on. I don't think we got that many left. Nope, we sure don't. And we got a crawler. Well, that one was fully on me, fully my fault. Okay, so I guess you can keep reactivating the song. I kind of wish that wasn't a thing. Even I want to get. Well, I don't know what the song is, but even if it was a good song, like constantly out in here, don't. It gets kind. It gets old. But that's just a personal gripe. Yeah, I mean, to me, these look like dig sites. I don't know. I just don't know if that, like, they're not finished or if they're not showing up as dig sites because there's a shovel somewhere. Since we got to go back to spawn to get quick revive, we'll check and see. There's just so many of them, it's making me think that there is something to it. Because I thought I felt like I'd done the uh, I searched this main area pretty good. Sixty nine. You know what? And since like we're trying to acquire points instead of double tap, I think I'm gonna get stamina up instead. So, if anybody asks, I killed myself on purpose. That's exactly what I did. Oh, yeah, I need to get a shield. Wait. Yes! God, that worked out good. Okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah, so maybe those aren't. Maybe those are just meant to, for aesthetic purposes. I don't know. So we do know we got to be careful with this LMG because, like, whenever you take and fire this thing, your guy starts going extremely slow. Oh, yes. Let's pop a reload real quick. Oh, oh. Okay, i got to be really careful around that area right there. I feel a lot better, though, now that i got quick revive. I mean, uh, stamina up instead of double tap. Just need to utilize this double points before it goes away. We just made back all the monies that we just spent on our perks, just right there. Maybe we should try, oh, maybe we should try doing a little zigzag right here. Because this is still a one-shot, so, like, you know, we still got plenty of stuff to clear the way. I, I kind of kept my LMG out a little too long right there. Okay, looks like we got everything spawned that way, yep. Okay. 
save a little ammunition here by using some grenades. Max ammo. And boom, just like that. Already at 38 G's, brothers. Would you just take a gander at them apples? I just want to buy the box, see if we can... I don't know what the Wonder Weapon is. Because there's supposed to be a custom Wonder Weapon. So... See, like, I barely nicked him with that, and it's still one-shot him, so... As far as I'm concerned, we essentially got a Wonder Weapon right here in our hands. Because if we ain't got to aim and we can maintain that mobility and that type of range. I just feel like right there is kind of a... We, we just got to keep doing this like figure eight pattern to come back through because they're like now that they're all sprinting, there's just too much of a tight squeeze through that area because they come off the staircase, both doors and from the field. So that's where I made my mistake. Boom. God dang, bro, we're going to beat through this and probably just probably going to finish this map in just over an hour if we keep going like this. Look, just got to remember my own god dang advice here and not try to squeeze through that tight spot right there. And also just not back too hard up against the wall. Oh, hello. Hello. I thought that was the last little handful of them. Gotta follow my own advice. Gotta follow my own advice. God dang it. I'm gonna finish off this little group with the pistol. Eh? Yeah, that seems to be the best approach, I think. It's just, like, kind of hanging out, like, here at the start. But yeah, very, very good uh, as far as like making a, a nice open area, uh, you know, a respectable amount of difficulty with the tall grass. Like that was a, that was a good idea. But this is like really a, a good figure eight setup. So like once we kind of know we got most all of them spawned, it's not that bad of an like it doesn't really hurt to run through this main area. But it's like you don't want to engage until you can kind of loop through that end and round them up again. The damage is starting to wane. This thing's ability for damage is starting to wane. But, like, honestly, we're going to be very close. We'll, we'll have 69k by the end of, uh... I don't know what that is, but if it's a max, I would love to have it. Don't think I'm going to be able to do it, though. Double points, even better. That's a max, though. Let's do the stupid. Ouch. God, now we still have double points. But we did need the max. Boom, just like that. So, um, look, just one point away. Actually, if we get this, it'll put us over 65K. Probably gonna get a monkey. Yep, or a, a bear, I meant, sorry. In my mind, I was correct.
There she goes. So, I mean, it does kind of suck that I wasn't able to see whatever this custom wonder weapon is, but, yeah, you know, not that big of a deal. <clears throat> you heard nothing. I think that we went down once, so that's kind of like unacceptable really I mean that was just that was me having a stupid uh, making a stupid mistake that was very easily avoidable okay probably about to make another stupid mistake I really want to buy the box again just to play my odds here okay that's the Barrett furthest thing from a wonder weapon hey and we got over 69k I mean we all know why he chose 69 you know instead of like having the question mark or whatever he put on the wall he should have put a 69 I don't think it was a 69 I'm pretty sure it was a question mark but if it was 69 I apologize for me having poor observation skills at the start of the match. Oh, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Boom. God damn, bro. Absolutely melting. The zombies with this thing. I'm glad we got this Bruin MK9. The Bruin MK9 was a good one on Modern Warfare. Okay, do the old loop de loop. Do the loop de loop and pull. Now your shoes are looking cool. I'm pretty sure that's how it went. Okay, we still spawning. Shield's not even went yellow on me. Now, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna break the eighty k wall here. Okay, think this is the last two. So I'm gonna just want to kind of take a peek and see where the box is, and then. Maybe we can pop the wonder weapon. Okay, it's all the way over here. But why not? I mean, it's like this video, once again, is probably just going to be like just a little bit over an hour. And I know you custom zombie fans like the longer videos. So, might as well just extend her a bit and just see if we can... Did I just kill that zombie? I have no, I don't know if my grenade missed like mystified him or if like this thing flipping ricochets or something because that that timing was a little Imagine if there wasn't even an like a wonder, a custom wonder weapon I just said that to kind of get you to Because I'm not seeing anything, com like, super funky. I bet this HDR is, like, actually a monster. Dude, like, how many times have we got the Barrett? I mean, like, I know they've named them different things, but... Okay, got the Scar. Feels like it'd be pretty hard-hitting. Hmm. 
box is very sniper heavy. Like, once I get down to 69k, we're just going to go buy the Bible ending. We'll see where she goes. Probably go somewhere mid-map. Do do do. You gotta be careful zooming in on things with the old sniper scope, though. You know because they'll uh, they'll throw one of them there jump scares at you. Ouch! Ouch! God dang it! Okay, so I thought there was going to be like a box right there in that room. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'm just full-blown retarded. So, you know, I know this is like riveting content it really is I bet this thing's actually very good even though it's a wall gun on here ooh mp5 that thing it's like this thing hadn't showed up a single time yet I feel like the odds the mathematical equation that's behind this box is a little off you feel me We've only got a few more spins. Okay, got the MTAR, or as they call it, the Mockingbird. Or the Tabor, actually, my bad. Okay. Essentially got one mole spin. But this one's actually very good. Hey, got the ray gun mark too. Oh my god. Hey, maybe this is the wonder weapon. Okay, yeah, look, I'm going to go pack-a-punch this, and I guess we'll play one more round, and then we'll go flipping 69. Wink, wink. Because I, I almost, I kind of guess this is going to be a, a uh, we'll get this, like, dual wield. No, we did not. But Jesus Christ at the ammo you get with this thing. Sorry. If you hadn't guessed, that was going to be the thumbnail. <laughs> so this thing, is, oh my god, so this thing is also shooting, a, essentially, snake shot. But we had, yeah, this is by, this is for sure the, uh, the wonder weapon. But I, you wouldn't even have to reload one time, you'd probably blast your way through a whole round. We can even we can even break our rule right here and just cut right through the middle. I 
That's ridiculous. In a good way. And look at the reload speed. This is one of those things like you literally, there's no excuse for dying if you got this, really. Not that we need it, but we got it. If I had to guess, this thing probably has like, you know, 900 or like 9,999 damage or like whatever the max damage is. Boom. Well. 28. Let's just, let's go finish her out, boys. So it was a question mark. I was right. 69k ask me if you want a real easter egg fit for sure bro throw us a real easter egg out there but finish the map like so we had that stupid stupid gay down that was fully my fault but a very very great fun map once again happy fourth of july brothers um hope you enjoyed the gameplay make sure you hit the thumbs up button subscribe if you haven't already share your friends check the link in the description of my other channels especially pro caliber hq go give it a sub give it a like give it some love and hit me up in that comment section until the next one adios